Hi guys, welcome to Facebook Live Wednesday. Uh, I've not done one of these for a while, my colleagues have been taking over. So um, yeah, as, as always, just list in the comments below what bikes you want to see and, uh, and I will uh, make my way around to them bikes for you. We are having a bit of a swap round in, uh, in the showroom at the minute just to try and fit all the bikes in. We've currently got in stock about a 600 bikes. Uh, Lewis, uh, Mace, can I have a look at the S? V thousand. Let me see if I can find it, mate. Suzuki Gladius. I've not seen an SV in for a while, to be honest. So I'll have to have a quick look round and see if there is one. I didn't even know we had one in, to be honest, mate. It's a bandit. Screechy one of the mechanics. Dorsodoro. We do have some. Well, we did have. Let me have a look. Oh, here we go. Oh, no, this is the SV650. Got a black SV650 in. Uh, this is only 2790 and it is done. Can you see that? 5,231 miles on that one, mate. Seen it on the website in black. Um, I've just got the. Uh, oh, there's another one here. Oh, here they are. This is a, a 650 again in white. Well, I can't find a black thousand. <whistles> Richard's asked for RC8. Glenn's asked for an, an RC8. We did have one left, RC8. If it's still here, we had an orange one in. No, it looks like the RC8's gone, mate. It, we did have a, we did have an RC8 just on the end here. Um, right, okay. Next one's just have Dorsodoro. Yeah, I'm sure we have. Well, we've got a lot of the Multistriders in. I don't know if we've actually got a Dorsodoro left. We did have one left, a black one. So as you can see, the showroom is packed, ready for the, uh, ready for the summer. Dorsodoro, Dorsodoro. There we go. I've got one in Mater, so I've not. There isn't a price list on it. So if you go onto uh, the website superbikefactory.co.uk, yeah, I've got a. Uh, doesn't let me just clean see the camera is clean and not. Um, this is on a 62 plate. It has only just come in. Has it still got the little plate on it? No, it's not been through the workshop yet. Um, so if you go onto our website, superbikefactory.co.uk, uh, and all the prices for the bikes will be on there for any 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 ones that you've seen. Uh, next one down, any Jixxer 750s? Yes, I have, James. But well, I've literally only got about three left, I think. Let me just have a quick look round. Uh, Ducati uh, 939. I don't think I've got any in, mate. Truda. So I'll get the, the people that normally follow us. We are uh, we are having a bit of a swap round in a minute, so we've moved all the uh, the touring bikes here, and the cruisers are now going along the back wall. Um, just makes it easier for the amount of um, the amount of the bikes that we're getting in at the minute. Uh, right, Jixxer 750. Um, let's have a look. Uh, got a thousand there. We've got a 750 there, which is the the Yoshimori one. This did sell last week, but the uh, for some reason it fell through and it went back on sale, which is nice. 
Uh, right, triumphs. What triumphs you want, Kate? Because I've got about from about hundred triumphs in at the minute. So, what uh, what style of triumph is it you're after? What model? Any YZF, Carl? Yeah, let's have a look around, mate. Uh, KTM 990 SMR. No, we don't have any in, mate. We don't really buy them in because the amount of uh, issues that we've had in the past with them. If we do buy them in, they're normally uh, normally quite mint with low mileage. Um, right, let's. So why is it? Thankfully, if you've noticed, the uh, the uh, guys in the showroom have done a fantastic job of actually. I don't know if you've noticed when we've looked over the 125s in the past, they've literally just been a muddle of all different bikes. They've, uh, they have uh, broken them down now into to makes models. So obviously you've got your MTs, your Dukes, uh, Aprilias, CBRs, and then obviously the most popular on the end there as soon as people walk in. So um, it was Carl that's asked any wise enough. As you can see, Carl, I've got many different styles, colours, and years. So to actually get a, an indication of what it is and your budget and stuff like that, whether it's on finance, if you just go onto our website, superbikefactory.co.uk, uh, and just have a look on there, and then you'll be able to see if any of them fit your price bracket. So uh, who's just asked? Richard's just asked for a S1000RR, my favourite choice. I've got one over here, actually, which is the same colour as mine. I think this one might have sold, but I can, I can show you around it. Yeah, it has. So this actually sold to one of my customers. Um, we did we did have about six or seven of these in just before Christmas, but they did all sell quite quick. Um, and I, I think that's going to be the case again now up until summertime, because they are the, obviously, for the money, they probably are the best bike you can buy, in my opinion. Uh, this one did sell for uh, £8,090, and it had only had 3,000 mile on from new as well. And it is the ABS version with the uh, quick shifter and heated grips on it. Uh, right, next, uh, someone has just asked for what supermotos do you have in stock? That was uh, Derek Aaron. Uh, supermotos, so we could probably start with the uh, this little beauty here, the Hyperstrada. Um, we've got, if you're on about super light, like CRF 250F supermoto style, you know, or the uh, I've got loads of the Hyperstriders in at the minute, different colours, see them all there, and then I've got uh, like the Crosser styles, uh, the Valators have uh, done a really good job at the minute actually breaking the bikes down into to models, which helps us salesmen and it helps customers as well when they come in to have a look at all different bikes. Triple R, you guys have might pop down on my day off. Yeah, Ryan, yeah, pop down. Um, come down at the weekend, have a look around the bikes and stuff. Z800, some of the Travis has just asked. Uh, we did have a white one in, but it sold straight away as soon as it come in. Um, let me have a look. Oh, someone asked me for the S1000 uh, sorry, SV1000 before. Yeah, I've just found it there. A black one. And an old four plate. Uh, what's the best one, two, five for a six foot three? Jesus, now, uh, uh, I'd probably say probably the MT one, two, five. I'd probably say one of these, to be honest, mate. Uh, MT one, two, five. So they are, they're, they're built like a 600, so if you look at the fork stanchions on this and how, how thick they are, and then you literally come round to like a, like a, a 600 to the same, same thickness, and even, even the frame and everything on the bikes, they're, uh, they're, they're for the money, for, the, for a 125, I think they're, you know, they're definitely the best one you can buy. They've got the same engine as a, as a YZF 125, they're just, they're just built that little bit stronger in my opinion. Um, they're probably the biggest ones for, for your size. Um, other than that, you've probably got a WR, which is one of them. So they're tall, I can't get my feet on the floor on them, but they're across the style. So it's just a matter of finding one that you really uh, you really fit with, to be honest with you. Uh, next one, what? I'll not do the 125s again, because I've had a look around there. Uh, Honda 
STE either 10 so ST1300 so you're on about a pan European for Gary um, again with these these obviously people know pans are quite uh, quite popular uh, this is the only one that we've got in a minute the uh, the 1300 and then in regard like model wise we've got a Kawasaki GT in Big old bus that, and then uh, obviously the cruisers and stuff now have all been shifted on. Uh, Scrambler one two five, yeah, right. It's just yeah, the Scramblers look really cool to be honest with you. Uh, we've not sold many of them, so we, we're not a bit unsure of like what the reliability like on them. Uh, but they do uh, they do look quite smart uh, as one. Well. And then we've got another Hamway one here as well that looks pretty cool. Yeah, they do. Uh, the one two fives have come on a long way. Even when I first started riding, like uh, they've, they've come on massively to what they used to be like. Yeah, really cool. Uh, right, any other ones? Let's have a look. Z800, someone mentioned before. Got quite a few. Right, okay. Let's see if anyone's. Yeah, any other questions guys just log on. I'll have a quick look around the uh, the setup and bags, uh see what bikes we've got in. Uh, we did have this one in that was uh that was priced really low, it sold pretty much straight away. That one yesterday was the R. Um, couple of loads of uh of speed triples in at the minute. Another Aprilia Dorsodoro. Uh, Z800 there, someone's just someone asked for one before, so we have got one in. And the amount of bikes that we get in at the minute, the to and from, we're, we're turning over about 30 bikes a day, um, which is a salesman's a nightmare because you can't can't keep on top of all the bikes you have in, but as business it's brilliant cause it just means you can get more bikes in and keep uh, keep on going. Uh, right, okay, it's amazing boy, uh, big boy, right after my license in April, so I'll pop down and keep on my day stuff. So. Yeah, uh, yeah, certainly pop down, Ryan. That's uh, not a problem at all, mate. Um, we do buy par taxes in. Um, do you have any uh, ZX, ZRX? No, we don't, mate. No. Uh, I was asking about the KTM RC 125s last week, and I've had Aprilia's and Yamahas. What they're like in comparison. Um, in my opinion, I love the RC 125s. I think they look brilliant. Um, they do hold the they do hold the value quite well. Um, out of the three bikes that you've probably you've had, I'd probably say the Yamaha was probably the better bike out out of the out of the three. Um, just for reliability, you know, and uh, and, and getting your money back as well. Um, I have got quite a few, as you can see now. So we are, like I say, we are really stocking up at the minute because we know at the moment we, we I mean today, it's just today alone we sold 28 bikes. So you know it's um, it is mental at the minute. But uh, certainly, uh, Logan, if you uh, if you want to give us a ring, we can uh, advise you a little bit more. Uh, I've just had another wiser FR come in, just been cleaned, ready to go out. Um, <laughs> yeah, you, sp uh, you spun your piston on it, yeah. That, that doesn't help. Uh, right, okay, someone's just asked for a uh, 1199. We've not, I think we're actually, oh no, no, no. We did have, uh, we did have one in. Yeah, here it is. Got one in. This is for Glen uh, Mannering. I've not got the price on this one, mate, because I think it's only been in about three days. But if you go onto our website, superbikefactory.co.uk, and uh, just have a look on there, that'll give you the price on it. But any information in regards to, to service history, <laughs> just give us a ring and we'll have a look. Uh, I have just spotted an SV. I have just pointed it out. Someone did ask for one. Um, this is the only SV tower I've got in. It's two and a half grand, 2,590 pound. Mileage on it is done. 26 it's got four service stamps up to 20,000 um, on that one that's a black one oh four plate my mate Tom got one of these uh, 
and you don't half give it some stick and it's uh, completely fine. Uh, right, okay, any other VFR 800s? Let's have a look because they're just over here. So I've got a couple of them. This is the only one I think I've got left, unless we've just got. We did have this red one in as well, but that sold pretty much to lights in there. It's terrible. Uh, got this one. Sandra's looking to do a test, definitely. The best thing I've, I've ever done in my life was do my bike test. Because it gives you that freedom of uh, the open road. Absolutely loads of higher boosters and uh, ZZRs in as well. Yeah, it's worth it, even if you, no, especially if you're, no, if you're a bike enthusiast, it's definitely worth coming down and just seeing the selection of bikes we've got. Um, weekends, we're always busy um, anyway, but if you, you certainly want to pop down and have a look. This, this weather, the weather this weekend's meant to be okay. Friday and Sunday's meant to be snowing, but uh, in Macclesfield, but on Saturday we're meant to have a nice dry day, so certainly uh, drag your partner out or come down with, you some, with your mates and have a look at the weekend and see what we've got in. Um, we are, like I say, redoing the showroom, so it's a bit much easier to, to walk around and, and, and see the bikes. Um, but yeah, other than that, if you need any questions, queries, want to know any information on bikes, just give me a ring. Just ask for, ask for Mark on the sale team, Mark Marshall, uh, and I'll, uh, I can get the packs out, have a look for you, and we can send you HD pictures across as well. Um, not a problem at all. Or even if you, you know, if you don't want to give us a ring, just go on superbikefactory.co.uk. Uh, and just have a look on there. Quick message to say thanks for my ZZR, great service, thanks. Oh, nice one, Richard. Um, right, I'll. Uh, oh, Richard Gamble, oh, you got it off me as well, I think, Richard, your uh, ZZR. Um, right, guys, I'm going to wrap it up now because uh, it's about minus four degrees in the showroom, my hand's getting cold. But, uh, like I say, any questions or queries or any advice on bikes or if you're selling a bike, just give us a ring, we're only a phone call away. Right, guys, speak to you soon. Ride safe.